Give our lads a beam weighing 80 pounds and they'll play for hours. Exercises like these, used in a special hardening course for officers and men of field force units, are looked upon as being a simple way of keeping in trim. These fellows are so tough that when they crack Brazil nuts, they put them between their eyelids and blink. Now here's a spot of rough house known as unarmed combat. Hurt themselves? <laughs> Don't be silly, they're only cobblestones. Exercise number three, hurdling a line of planks and scaling a 12-foot wall with full equipment and rifle. There's nothing to it, really, especially when you're fed on a diet of raw meat and flat wheels off steamrollers. Here comes the last man over. He's the bloke that all the others have been trampling underfoot. Nicely done, fellas. Now let's see you going in for a swim with all your clothes on. Here they go, taking to the water like a gaggle of geese. Nothing like it, you know. Thank heaven. Of course, it's a lot nicer when there's ice about because it's so much more invigorating. Another thing about it is this. British battle dress doesn't shrink. The trousers don't girt you under the armpits when you begin to dry off. Mind you, the war office won't make things as easy as this when the next age group is called up. But after all, it's really child's play compared with what they do in the more advanced classes.